Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to another vlog. Today, I'm going to be sharing a day in my life as a nurse vlog. And one of the very first things I do is I head to the kitchen and I make my coffee, of course, after I wash my face, brush my teeth. One of my favorite coffees is the Donut Shop Nutty and Caramel Duo. It's been my go-to for a while now. So my shift starts at 8, but I got up at 4 because I wanted to make sure I gave myself plenty of time before going to work. I also wanted to stick to my routine as much as possible. So my favorite creamer is the Vanilla Silk Almond Creamer. And I do measure my creamer because I love to get carried away sometimes. I find that three tablespoons of creamer is the perfect amount for me. So I really take this time to get a few things done and to relax before starting my shift. So I'll make my grocery list. And I also like to journal. Now, I don't journal every single day, but I like to journal when I'm feeling anxious, nervous, or I have a lot going on. And it is my first day of work, so I was definitely nervous, anxious, and all of the above. I like to write down what I'm grateful for. And I use it as a way to talk to God aside from prayers. I also take this time to check my Facebook, my Instagram, and then I head back into the bathroom and I shower. I have to shower every single morning. I do my skincare routine and I love using CeraVe products. I use their facial moisturizing lotion with sunscreen and I use their body lotion. After I'm feeling more awake, I head back into the kitchen and I start making my breakfast. I can't cook when I'm feeling sleepy weepy. So my go-to breakfast is two brown eggs, some turkey bacon and bagel. I do switch it up sometimes though. So after enjoying my breakfast, I head back into the bathroom and finish getting ready. I brush my teeth again and then I start doing my makeup. I use a little bit of concealer to cover up my blemishes. I use brown eyeshadow, some mascara, and then I also use a little bit of blush. I love the difference that the blush makes. And I also do a little bit of lip gloss, nothing too crazy. I like doing my makeup because I feel more put together. And then after that, I decide what I'm going to wear. And this can take a while. So after getting dressed, I start doing my hair. My go-to hairstyle is a bun. I wear my hair up in a bun almost every time I go to work. And then I wear my favorite Kendra Scott earrings and I am ready for work. Hey guys, good morning, it's 6.58 and I'm all dressed and ready for work. So I just have to get my lunch together and then I'm gonna go through my backpack and just make sure that I have everything that I need in there. So I'll be working eight to six today. It's my first day of work, I'm pretty nervous, but I'm very excited, just ready to get this over with. So I finished my training, I think two weeks ago. They texted me last week and they asked if I could come in Saturday, which is today, and this coming Tuesday. So I'm happy that I get to work this week, and I'm also happy that I got my first check yesterday. I'm very excited about that. They paid me for the hours of training, and yeah, it feels good to have a check in there because I haven't worked in almost two years. I'm very grateful for that, and yeah, I'll be working eight to six. Hopefully everything goes good. I wanna get there at least by 7.20, that way I can make sure I'm logged into the systems and I don't wanna be running late. So let me go ahead and get my lunch ready. I'll show you guys what I'm taking for lunch. This is my lunch for today. It's some pasta that I made last night. I prepped my lunch and dinner for today because I didn't wanna to cook today. I just wanna get off work and relax. 
So I added some cheese this morning. And then for snack, I have my favorite yogurt, which is this cherry yogurt. And then if I want something sweet, I have this Jello, the sugar-free Jello. I love these. And then last night I prepped my lunch bag. So I have some utensils, a paper towel, and I got this lunch bag from Amazon. Just FYI. Okay, so journal check, little book check, gum check, and then I have my stethoscope, scissors, my watch, pens, pen lights, and my ID badge. And my ID badge is in there. Okay, guys, so it's 7.29. I'm here pretty early, and if you saw my last vlog, then you know that I was stressing over the systems because it's a system that I haven't worked before. But the last day of training, we did play with the system and I did an intake for a patient so that made me feel so much better we did run through our skills really quickly she watched me do an IV a lab draw or two lab draws and what else oh yes I, I did the intake for a patient using the system I'm feeling a bit better about that we'll just see how today goes since I haven't been here in two weeks we'll see how well I remember the system I know it's gonna be a learning process but I'm just gonna give it my best and try to remember where everything is hey guys it's 8 40 and I just want to give you guys a quick run through or a little summary of what happened today at work. So it was very overwhelming, but I knew this was gonna happen. It's my first day of work. So I expected it to be very overwhelming and stressful, and it was. But I kinda just wanted to get today over with because I think the first day of work is always the most stressful and the most overwhelming. Did have a good day overall, but I did have a lot of bumps throughout the day. So starting off with the million questions that I had, and I think that's the most stressful part of it all, the questions. Like if you guys have been new before, then you know what I'm talking about. I had a million questions throughout the day, and it's like we were super busy. So if y'all have ever been new anywhere, then y'all know how stressful it is when you have a million questions. You don't wanna bother anyone because you know they're super busy and we had a super busy day. I know for sure we saw more than 20 patients. Um, I wanna say we saw 30 or maybe even more than 30. It was super busy. Super busy from the moment we opened to pretty much till we closed. It did kinda slow down around five-ish, but we were so busy throughout the day. So yes, I had a million questions, but that was expected. Like I knew I was gonna have a lot of questions. I knew that today was gonna be a mess. But I do have to say that after today, I feel a little bit better about the system. And I'm kinda getting a flow going. So that's good. There at the urgent care center, we do a lot of things. So we see a lot of things. What I like about working there is that even though I didn't start at the hospital, I'm still gonna get to do a lot of my skills. So I'll be doing IVs, splints, lab draws, what else, EKGs, a lot of different things. So I'm very happy about that. And yeah, it's really a really fast paced environment. So my day went by pretty quickly. So yeah, we'll just see how Tuesday goes. And if y'all have any questions, please leave them down below. I think I'm gonna wrap up this vlog and go to sleep. It's 8.58, so I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.